Hello everyone, today I am going to tell in my opinion, the confused characters in Genshin Impact. Everyone's always talking about the best characters, but as an autistic person who struggles to use Hu Tao or Child, I'll tell you the best characters to use if you have a hard time with reaction times or anything of the similar. Now, let's begin. I would say Nuvelet is the comfiest character in all of Genshin Impact. His skill and burst give you stacks for your charged attacks, and you can do your charged attacks even without them. You can also move while you're in your skill, and since he scales with HP, you don't have to worry about dying, unless you pair him with Purina. You will need a shield with him however, if you're looking for comfy gameplay. You should be doing that in the first place. Also fuck this talent domain. I think Yuimiya is very underrated for people that wish to play comfortably. You don't have to move, just auto attack over and over. Yes, she can only target one enemy at a time, but she's great for bosses. And unlike Hu Tao, you don't have to learn how to jump cancel. Plus, with double hydro, anything is possible. Boss that will stay in one place when. El Gatham, I mean El Haytham. While recording this, I realized his playstyle annoys me, because I actually have to get close to the enemy SMA. However, Mike knew to let his skill and burst, make his charged attacks all special and doing. A charged attack can also infuse him with Dendro. Doing this domain took fucking forever I'm going. Back to Ayaka freeze after this. Speed up time. A Haytham's crit ratio is abysmal by the way. While Zhongli is the best shielder for staying safe, other shielders do their jobs just as well. Lala has great cryo application as well as having an almost unbreakable shield. Kiara also has a very good dendro shield. Even if she's not the best at application, characters such as Toma and Baiju have okay shielding. However, Baiju is more a healer, and I prefer Xinyin over Toma. Weird opinion I know, but Xinyin's shield is tankier. Diona also exists I guess. I prefer Lala over her though as Diona's shield cooldown is too long and the 80 energy cost burst isn't worth it to me. Noelle also exists for any early game players however. Her burst is also pretty pricey, and her skill cooldown is long. Unlike shielders, Healers mostly do the same thing, heal. Some have other things as well, but their main reason for being there is to heal. Jean, Nail, and Barbara are okay healers. Not the best, but they will do. Dory sucks. Don't use Dory. Cookie is good for Hyper Bloom teams. Kokomi is good for most teams. Baiju is good. Bennett is good if you want. First only healing Diona is the same as Bennett. Sayu is okay, but she's better as a driver than a healer. I forgot about Yao Yao and Charlotte, but they're both very good and Charlotte underrated. Yao Yao is very good for Dendro application as well as healing your entire team, while Charlotte is great for a field cryo application and a quick burst heal. If you need as much healing as physically possible, Chi Chi is your best bet. However, she doesn't get particles on casting. Her skill and her burst cost is hefty. My favorite units for away from keyboard playing are Furina, Fischl, and Nahida because if you use these three, you don't even have two. Normal attack if you don't want to. However, Cookie and Yaoya are good as well for Hyper Bloom. Albedo is good if you want to keep yourself shielded with crystallized props. Molo also exists. So does Xiangling. Her burst is really annoying to get though. Like I said before, Charlotte is underrated for her cryo. Application as well as Lala Ganyu can also be used. Besides the ones I stated besides Raiden for Hyper Bloom teams, I don't really suggest any of the other fielders for away from keyboard gameplay. For Shin Chikyu and Yellen, you have to be constantly there to attack. So even if they're very good, in this context, they don't work. Cryo application thumbs up emoji. I literally have been procrastinating this because I don't know what else to say I'm done.
I'm tired, and I just wanna get this video out, because my brain isn't into it anymore. Sad ADHD, sad face emoji. Hope you enjoyed this video since this is the first time I'm trying something like this. Was it helpful? Who knows? Did I try my best? Yes. Bye bye.